like and subscribe right now or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. Our world contains around 8.7 million animal species, ranked by their placement in the animal kingdom. They vary from mammals to birds, fish, reptiles, amphibians, and invertebrates. While some of them may seem very cute and gentle, others may be the direct opposite. Just as violence exists in human nature, it is very common to find violence among animals too. Often, two species will fight with each other for dominance. As the world evolved over millions of years, these crazy angry creatures became pretty well accustomed to fight with one another. So, for today's video, we'll be talking about 10 of the craziest fights in the animal kingdom. Be sure to stick with us through the entire video. 10 Craziest Fights in the Animal Kingdom Number 10. Eagle vs. Cheetah this battle is between two of the fastest animals on Earth. While eagles have a maximum speed ranging from 120 to 160 kilometers per hour, or 74 to 100 miles per hour, cheetahs have a top speed of 130 kilometers per hour, or 81 miles per hour. It seems that the cheetah would obviously win. However, the answer to this may vary. Cheetahs, being carnivores, are really fast and go after a large variety of prey. However, their chasing speed develops over time. This means that they are not always fast hunters. Sometimes they become the victims too. This is exactly what happens with cheetah cubs. Often, eagles come out of nowhere and try to pick up the cheetah cubs with their sharp claws. Even though their mothers try to defend their cubs, eagles are very agile and often succeed in snatching up the cubs to trees to devour. The mother may try to follow the eagle, but they usually fail in saving their cubs. Number 9. Warthog vs. Rhino well, warthogs may seem like tough little pigs, but they are no match when it comes to fighting the mighty rhinos. Rhinos are animals that you never want to make angry, considering the white rhino specifically. White rhinos are huge, weighing a massive 2,300 kilograms, or 5,070 pounds. This massive size is not the only feature that makes it superior. Their sharp front horn, which has the growing capacity of 61 centimeters or 24 inches, is their most crucial weapon in damaging any other victim in its way. One famous YouTube video came out which recorded a white rhino attacking a warthog. Things were pretty peaceful when the white rhino and a warthog were sharing food from the same stack. It seemed that the warthog did not create any disturbance to the rhino. However, the rhino still may have felt irritated, suddenly tossing the poor warthog high into the air with its horns. This shows that no animal should mess with rhinos. Number 8. Bison Calf vs. Wolf Bisons are big and strong animals, where, on the other hand, wolves are very fast and intellectual. So, how competitive can their fight be? However, the fight that took place was not between a grown-up bison and a wolf. Rather, the incident that was shot on video was a fight between a bison calf and a wolf. This clip contained a hungry wolf planning to fulfill its hungriness by attacking a baby bison separated from its herd. As the herd of bison were crossing the water, the bison calf got left behind and became the target of a wolf. However, the bison defended itself against the wolf's bite and even started an initiative fight with the wolf, creating enough time for its herd to come and stop the wolf. What a great spirit that baby bison had! Number 7. Hippo vs. Buffalo here we talk about two of Africa's most magnificent beasts. The question remains though, which one of these non-predatory herbivorous beasts can beat each other in a fight? Whereas buffaloes weigh around 1,000 kilograms or 2,200 pounds, hippos are heavier, as they are in a completely different category. Sometimes they weigh three times more than a buffalo. Buffaloes use their horns for defense. Hippos use their massive crushing incisor teeth within their huge mouths to crush their enemies. A fight took place between a buffalo and a rhino near a water body. As the buffalo came to drink water, the hippo became aware and decided to guard its territory. The buffalo actually thought it could take on the rhino. However, the victory went to the rhino as the buffalo fled from the scene quickly, just as the hippo made a move and opened its huge mouth. Number 6. Elephant vs. Lion Elephants vs. Lions are becoming a common fight to watch online. Victory often seems to go to the male lions when they are able to bring down young elephants. Both animals are competitive in their own way. While lions can damage elephants considerably with their harsh bites, elephants can also harm lions using their trunk tusks and heavy feet. A volatile fight took place between a lioness and a young female elephant in a guided safari in Zimbabwe. It started with the lioness targeting the elephant and clinging to it with its sharp claws and teeth. The female elephant tried relentlessly to remove the lion from its body. 
Angered and in pain with bites from the lion's teeth and the sharp claws, the elephant was motivated to keep fighting. The elephant screamed and used its strength to swing the lion around into the air. The elephant then used its final strategy, lowering its head, pushing the lioness to the ground. Lastly, the elephant made chase behind the lioness, which was enough for the lioness to understand that she lost the fight. Number 5. Honey Badger vs. Snake Snakes are really one of the most dangerous animals, right? And we may think that they can easily kill or at least inflict some damage with their venom to whatever prey they find. However, in the case of many deadly snakes, they too cannot defeat a honey badger. Honey badgers are mammals and have the ability to directly face and fight snakes. It is a very ferocious animal and relies more on force and tenacity rather than using stealthy methods to kill snakes. During their face-off with any snake, when they get too involved in the fight, they end up killing the snake by lunging in and biting, even swiping the snake's head off. Honey badgers are able to prevent penetration of fangs due to having thick, loose skin with a layer of thick, slick hair. They're even said to be relatively immune to snake venom. Number 4. Octopus vs. Shark Sometimes, octopuses do hunt smaller sharks, but this does not happen often. The probability of such a situation depends on when small sharks get very near to the octopus. Also, octopi mostly go after prey that is smaller than themselves. They use their force to overcome substantial enemies, which includes sharks too. Octopuses are opportunists and will often use their fierce beak or spiky radula to bury into its offenders. At one aquarium in Seattle, a huge Pacific octopus ate the dogfish shark with whom it shared its accommodation with. This was a very shocking incident indeed. Many octopi carry venomous bites and some of their venom is powerful enough to paralyze their victims. However, it's not always a winning situation for octopuses. Sharks are carnivores, and many hammerhead sharks are known to eat octopuses. So, the fight depends on what type of shark and octopus. Number 3. Badger vs. Fox In this point, we're not talking about honey badgers anymore, but rather about ordinary badgers. Well, the relationship between badgers and foxes may vary. European badgers are very close friends with foxes. They even share a den with foxes, which the badgers keep neat, whereas in return, the foxes provide the badgers with scraps of food. However, it's the opposite in America, as the relationship between badgers and foxes is not that civilized. The American badger, being a fossorial carnivore, often looks for its prey underground by digging or scouting out dens. Although foxes are not their main source of food, badgers are known to attack fox dens to take fox cubs when the male or female fox is away. A badger can kill a fox, as they are very tough, aggressive, and persistent when it makes up its mind to catch prey. If foxes have a choice, they won't take on a badger, as they are just a too aggressive and tough opponent to fight. Number 2. Crocodile vs. Wild Boar Crocodile vs. Wild Boar is not actually much of a fight. In reality, this fight lasts for just a few seconds. That's the time the crocodile needs as it will prey by clamping its huge jaws onto the head of a wild boar after silently hiding under the shallow water. Then, as it crushes the wild boar, it pulls it into the water. Crocodiles often perform a death roll, which is a method of spinning their prey around and around in the water until it drowns. The poor wild boar does not even stand a chance in winning against the croc's huge jaw. To do this, the crocodile chops the wild boar by slamming it into the water with a truly aggressive turn of the head. Some may wonder if it is ever possible for a wild boar to kill a crocodile. The answer is absolutely no. Number 1. Lion vs. Tiger Here comes the ultimate battle with the ultimate question. Who would win in a fight between a lion versus a tiger? Both of the two cats are considered to be some of the most ferocious predators on land. Tigers are said to be the ruler of the jungle, whereas lions are considered to be kings of the plains. Considering their sizes, tigers are heavier, as they can weigh up to 363 kilograms or 800 pounds, compared to a lion's 227 kilograms or 550 pounds. Coalitions of male lions usually go into combat as a group against territorial enemies, so a tiger may have an advantage only in a one-on-one -on -one encounter. One-on-one -on -one is the common fighting scenario or combat mode for a tiger, but a lion coalition of two to three males would have an easy advantage over a lone tiger, and a group of two to four female lions would have the same advantage over a lone tigress. Other than that, anything can happen in a one-on-one -on -one fight. It may be a win for the tiger, or maybe a win for the lion.
That is all for today's video. Thank you all for watching. While you're here, go ahead and click on one of these two videos on your screen. See you there.